as you noticed in the reading cubby, we had a lot of dinosaur books out. And when we did that puzzle, matching up all the different dinosaurs, the dinosaur dominoes, we are going to start talking about dinosaurs this month. And every day we're going to have a new dinosaur of the day. Yes. Just like we did with the birds. Do you I remember? Have that one. And we put all the pictures up there. We're going to do that with dinosaurs. I have that one. And I was thinking to myself. I have that You do? Okay, so listen. I was thinking to myself that it makes sense that we're doing the birds of, we did the birds of the day, and now we're doing the dinosaurs of the day because you know what? They're cousins. I know. Can you believe that a bird is related to a dinosaur? What does that mean? Well, the dinosaurs came the birds. Birds came. Everybody, like, did you watch Birds Jurassic came later. Park? Okay, so listen. No, dinosaurs have a lot of the you same. Like, Samantha, please listen. Dinosaurs have a lot of the same bones that birds did. They're kind of hollow. Um, and, and you can't tell on the dinosaur that I'm holding in my hand because he's plastic. But if you look at my picture, kind of looks like he has feathers on his body. Some dinosaurs did, which is kind of cool. Does anybody know the name of this dinosaur? It's a raptor. Yes. I know raptors. It's a raptor, but what kind of raptor? There's lots of raptors. I know raptors. It's not a T-Rex. It's a raptor. His name is Velociraptor. I, I, I know that one. He is very, very smart. Tap your brain. He is one of the smartest dinosaurs that ever lived. And I know how to write my name. But you know what? He's only as tall as, like, your dad. He's not very big. My daddy is very this tall. He may be very tall, my but when it... Okay, so listen, but when it comes, no, listen, hold on, no, no, listen, but when it comes to dinosaurs, I always think that dinosaurs are way bigger than daddies, right? Like, I don't even think I could fit a dinosaur in our classroom, but this guy is not very big, but he's very smart, and he's very ferocious. Mm -hmm. He's got very sharp claws on his hands and his feet because he's a hunter. He likes to eat meat. He runs on two feet, which makes him very fast to catch his and dinner. He's, and he's like, he's like a one, he's like a person. He one. stands like a person, doesn't he? But he has three legs. He has four, actually. One, two, three, four, but he stands on two. That makes him super fast to catch his dinner. And when he does, he's got those sharp teeth and those sharp claws that helps him eat the meat that makes him strong. Okay. I think the dinosaurs be strong too. They can eat the meat. I think they do. I think they I think their claws help them take out their food. It do, they do. And they not all dinosaurs eat meat, What's but this meat? one does. And you know how I know that? Because he's got sharp claws and sharp toes on his feet, and he runs on two feet. That makes him very fast. Well, I want the dinosaurs to be strong to eat the spiders that I don't. Should we measure him? Should we see how big he really is? Okay, we're going to go into the hallway, and we are going to measure this guy and see how long he is. So what I would like you guys to do is to get up and get your face masks on or your gaiters so we can do that real quick. I have a mask. It's in your mailbox, so just go grab I it do. out, put it on, and come back to your line. I will get on my